If your vehicle came from the factory with 4x6 sealed beam headlight housings, you probably already know that upgrading to an LED type housing is a great way to increase style, safety, and performance of your headlights. Some common 4x6 sealed beam headlight part numbers are 1A1 and 2A1, 4656 and 5001. If your original sealed beam headlights match any of those part numbers, something on the table in front of me would be a great direct replacement. As you can see, there's a lot of different options you can choose from, and it's hard for you to know which one's the best for your project. So we went and picked the most popular, best 4x6 LED headlights on the market today, and we will compare them in this video series with beam pattern, advertised lumen rating, and maximum lux using this digital light meter. Back when automotive LED headlights were new, Truck Light is the company that created the first seven inch round sealed beam LED headlight. Well, today they have a brand new 4x6 LED headlight that's pretty impressive. It's not the most expensive, but it's easily one of the best quality and the brightest. It's an interesting design because it's not a black housing, but it looks black. The way that this works is the top section of the headlight has a heat sink, a driver, and an LED built in, and it shines down into the reflector and the beam pattern casts out from the reflector like this and each of the different reflector surfaces helps to position and create the beam pattern in a certain way. And the reason you get this really cool blackout effect is because the reflector is chrome, like a mirror, but if you look up inside here, the circuit board is black. So the reflector is reflecting the black circuit board and you get a really stealthy, cool look to the headlight. The truck light 4x6 comes in a single beam, low beam, part number 27640C3, and a single beam high beam, part number 27645C3. You can find these on our website at headlightrevolution.com or check out the link in the description below this video. The low beam and the high beam housings look almost identical. This one's the low beam, this one's the high beam. The biggest distinction to tell them apart on the front is the shape of the bottom of the lens and the shape of the center section of the reflector. You can see the low beam has two square notches and the center section has more reflective surfaces. And the high beam is kind of notched a couple times on either side of the reflector bowl and the center section is more clear. It doesn't have so many different pieces of uh, reflective housings all in one area. It's just one big reflector. Now if you flip it around to the back, you can see that the low beam has three wires coming out the back and the high beam only has two. This is because on a lot of vehicles, the low beam is on the outside and it stays on when you switch it to high beam. So whether you're energizing the single low beam circuit or the single high beam circuit, your outside headlights will always be on. And then the only thing that would change is your high beam would flip on when you go to high beam. You've got the heat sink up top, you have the wires coming in to a really nice waterproof connector and you have a moisture vent right next to that. It's simple, it fits, and it works. Next, we're gonna compare beam patterns, lumens per headlight, and maximum lux at 25 feet. The way we're gonna do that, we're gonna set each headlight up 25 feet away from this wall, and then we're gonna use our digital lux meter to measure the lux at a certain point. So what's the difference between lumen and lux? Why do you never hear about lux? Honestly, to get the whole picture, you need to compare the three things. The shape of the beam pattern, is it a good beam pattern? The lumen of the LED, is it creating a lot of light? And lastly, how do those two things work together to create a good amount of usable light in front of your vehicle? That's why we measure lux. Now keep in mind, this is semi-scientific. We're using this to measure every single point of the beam pattern, and we're just gonna tell you the one point in the whole beam pattern that was the brightest. That's gonna be our benchmark for every single headlight. So to get a good feel for what's important, watch all of our videos on all of the 4x6 LED headlight options and compare them yourself. If your vehicle comes with sealed beam headlights, this is what they look like. It's not a very wide beam pattern. It doesn't have a sharp cutoff line and the light color is this dingy yellow. Now this is low beam and we measured it at only 650 lux at 25 feet. And here's high beam. You notice it doesn't get any brighter. We measured it again at 650 lux at 25 feet, and the beam pattern just shifts up a little bit. The truck light low beam 4x6 is part number 27640C. 
has a raw lumen output of 850. Effective lumen output is unspecified. We measured maximum lux at 25 feet of 1,140 lux. It's DOT approved, made in the USA with a three year warranty, and draws only 1.5 amps of power at 12 volts DC. Available in black housings only. The truck light 4x6 high beam is part number 27645C, raw lumen output of 850 lumens per lamp, unspecified effective lumen output, and we measured a maximum lux at 25 feet of 2,080 lux per lamp. It's DOT approved, made in the USA with a three year warranty. Draws 1.2 amps at 12 volts DC and available in black. Remember, there's more to picking out your headlight than just the lumen rating. Watch all of our videos for comparisons on beam pattern, lumen, and lux by subscribing to our channel so you don't miss a single 4x6 LED headlight review. You can also find us on Facebook, Google Plus, and Instagram. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next time.